Art the Clown is a menace. Yeah, that's right. No time for a creative intro. Welcome to the channel. I'm Buster Brown, blah, 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 blah. Terrifier 3 is actually terrifying. And I know, shocker, but sweet baby. Jesus, this movie is crazy. You thought Terrifier 1 was bad? You thought Terrifier 2 was bad? Imagine the bedroom scene. You know the one I'm talking about. But it's like the whole freaking movie. Bro, I don't even know what to say. And of all things, it's set during Christmas, the most wonderful time of year. Instead of Santa Claus coming to town, it's Santa Claus comes to town and then Art kills him in the most brutal, violent way possible. Frosty the Snowman. If you've seen the movie, you know why I just sang that after mentioning Santa Claus. This movie was gory, bloody, violent, and it does not let up throughout the entire runtime. Not for one second was I bored because I was always wondering, where's Art gonna come? When's he gonna pop out of the corner? And it's not for the usual jump scare, bullcrap shenanigans where you're just scared of going, oh, oh, well, that was it. No, you're scared of watching a two minute torture session featuring Art the Clown and some poor nameless victim that sometimes has a name, but whatever. I am just uh, the, the grossest movie that I've ever seen in theater. And if no, maybe if you're someone who just watches snuff films or I don't know, torture for fun, then you'll walk in and be like, yeah, this is fine. This is a okay, average, decent movie, solid time. But for someone like me who loves slashers like Friday the 13th, Halloween, Nightmare, on Elm Street. Art the Clown in Terrifier 3 takes it to a whole nother level. I don't even want to de describe what he does in this movie out of fear of demonetization. And you know what bothers me the most about Art the Clown? He's so flippin' funny and i get so mad that i like him so much and he makes me just laugh all the time because i'm like i'm not supposed to be laughing at this this is violent and gross and disturbing but his mannerisms and expressions are so next level and you just know what's going on it's this little sick twisted sadistic mind that you just can't help but laugh with art while also wincing in pain because you feel bad for these poor people. Even the a-holes don't deserve what's coming to them. Like you feel in maybe a Friday the 13th. No, you're like, dog. Art just kills people for fun. David Thornton, the actor that plays Art the Clown, is so good in this role that it makes me question what he's like in real life. I mean, he is constantly topping his expressions, mannerisms, funny gags in the first two movies. He bumps it up a level in Terrifier 3. And you know what? After two weeks straight of crazy clowns between Joker Folia Do and Terrifier Terrifier 3, I'm getting a little sick of these crazy clowns, but you want to know something kind of funny? Terrifier 3 is more of a Joker and Harley Quinn movie than the Joker and Harley Quinn movie that came out last week because there's this chick named Vicky who used to be a perfectly normal person until she came across Art the Clown's warpath and now he's somehow corrupted her into being his partner in crime and helping him carry out these sadistic violent kills where she now dresses up as a clown as well. I'm just saying. Not to mention that as I said, Art the Clown's actually funny. No offense to Joaquin Phoenix, Arthur Fleck, but bro, our crowd was dead silent. Art the Clown does something Something. Our whole audience is laughing and then you see people's intestines. Terrifier 3 shook me guys. I'm gonna be honest This isn't so much of a review as me just telling you how freaking scarred I am from seeing art the clown in action and That alone should let you know whether or not you should watch this movie. Yeah, sure There's some character work going on Sienna from like the second movie is back She's dealing with some PTSD schizo nightmares or brother's here too, suffering from some of the same things, her family's mistreating her, whatever, I don't care. You know why you're here, okay buddy? If my reaction excites you and you're like, man, then you need to see this movie. If my reaction terrifies you, then you probably should not see this movie under any circumstances because this is one of, if not the most violent 
gory, bloody, sadistic, sinister, diabolical movies I have ever seen. And hey, that's the video. Thank you all so much for watching. Merry Christmas, happy holidays. Let me know what you thought of Terrifier 3. If you saw it, are you gonna see it? Did you love it? Did you hate it? Were you disgusted? All three at the same time? I wanna hear in the comment section down below. With that, thank you all so much for watching and I will see you later.